There have been a lot of conversation about these hooded men in the next coming episode of Bored, so I'm here to basically talk about it and give my opinion upon them. And one of the most popular theories about these hooded men is that they have some sort of connection with the Kata or Kawaki in this situation. I feel like that's pretty much not going to be the case, but I'll pretty much explain to you guys why a lot of people feel like they probably do have some sort of connection to Kawaki. Now, I feel like this theory basically stems from this guy right here. It's not necessarily from the quote unquote Byakuya gang that they're going to be coming into contact with. And next episode but it's really this guy this guy that really has side of the meat skin board to trap into his eye style and again what i do want to stress to a lot of you guys is that this doesn't have to be or this doesn't necessarily have to be anyone from the kata that we've seen in the boruto manga and wait before i jump ahead of this because i'm pretty sure a lot of you guys probably don't read the manga or probably don't watch my videos on the manga the kata is pretty much like the akatsuki of boruto they're going to be a very interesting and a very powerful organization in boruto and probably nine times out of ten in boruto shippuden as well they have a lot of connections with Boruto and Kawaki. Now, if you guys want to know more, just watch my manga videos. I'm not going to go over the whole thing in this video. But back to what I was saying, what I do want to say is that this person right here doesn't have to be a specific member of the Kata that we've seen in the manga before. And as you guys know, the Kata basically considers its members insiders and they have a lot of outsiders, quote unquote, and they all wear this hooded thing. As you guys see right here, the manga, they all have the hoods on. And also right here, this guy, he also has a hood on as well. So it's a very good possibility that this guy can possibly be an outsider of the kata now it's impossible for me to say for sure that this has nothing to do with the kata at all so i want you guys to take everything with a grain of salt and everything you're probably seeing on youtube about this kata and this hooded man is pretty much a lot of speculation and no one really knows as of right now now the spoilers didn't really talk about this right here the only thing that they really talked about is that there was going to be a righteous gang they basically steal things from the rich and give it to the less fortunate now i'm guessing the resounding opinion is that this guy has nothing Nothing to do with that quote unquote Byakuya gang and it's pretty much a rogue ninja or this pretty much a guy working on his own and I think again it's possible but I strongly doubt it mainly because one this right here is not the arc for that as you guys know the Boruto manga as of right now is dealing with the Kata organization I feel like when the anime does catches up to the manga then we're gonna actually get to see a little bit of hints and a little bit of traces of the Kata organization I don't think it's gonna happen as of right now now right now we do have the getting Boruto arc we're gonna be getting to see a lot of missions with Boruto. Hopefully, we do get to see a lot more fighting and more entertaining episodes with Boruto. Also, after that, in a couple of weeks, I'd give it about eight to twelve weeks. We're gonna see the tuning exam. I'm not sure how long the tuning exam is gonna be, but after the tuning exam, we can expect for Boruto to go on a little bit more missions, see how Boruto interacts with Sasuke, things like that. And then afterwards, eventually, we will go into the Kata organization. And I actually don't think that Boruto or anybody else are gonna fight anybody within the Kata organization like the quote-unquote insiders but obviously we know Boruto, Konohama and everybody else are gonna be fighting with Al. Now when I do feel like the Kata are gonna be introduced and we get to formally see how strong these guys are I feel like that's gonna eventually be in Boruto Shippuden when Boruto gets older or it could be one of those situations where one of my subscribers told me where Boruto Shippuden starts with Boruto versus Kawaki and Kawaki is going to be eventually introduced in the regular Boruto when Boruto is about 13 and then we understand why they would be fighting in the first episode of Boruto Shippuden, I think that could possibly be a very interesting thing, man, because that's all everybody's talking about as of right now in terms of the long term and the overall big picture of Boruto. Now, again, I strongly doubt that this guy is going to have anything to do with the Kata, but I'm telling you guys, it's possible because not a lot of people know what the writers are going to be thinking about. As you guys know, if you guys think back to the Akatsuki, when we first seen traces of the Akatsuki, we seen Itachi visit. Now, at that time, we had no idea how big of a role the Akatsuki was going to play. And it was pretty much a surprise to see, like, wow, these guys are extremely strong. So it's not out of the range or it's not out of the characteristics for these guys or the writers to just sprinkle in a little bit of the kata to get us thinking ahead a little bit more. But I strongly doubt this right here is going to be the guy to do it. But again, anything is possible. One thing I can say is I can't wait till we do actually see the kata and see how they are in terms of the animation and see them being animated in a cartoon or an anime. I feel like that's going to be a very interesting time. Now, if I were to give my opinion on what this guy actually is i feel like he's probably part of that byakuya gang that everybody is basically going to be fighting or everybody's going to be having that ethical talk with themselves about should they actually destroy or should they actually report and capture all these members of the byakuya gang the righteous thieves i think he's going to be part of that he's probably going to be a decoy for what they're going to actually be trying to do as you guys know boruto and his friends are basically going to be sent out on the mission and i'm pretty sure they know or they have a certain situation or a certain protocol to avoid ninja being called in to basically 
stop them from doing what they're doing so that's pretty much what i feel like it is but i'm telling you guys right now it still is possible for this guy to have something to do with the kata organization that could possibly be a foreshadowing to the kata but i really want to ask you guys do you guys think that they would be throwing in any easter eggs or any hints towards the kata this early in the board or series if you guys do let me know in the comment section below because honestly this is very interesting but make sure you guys comment with the hashtag notification squad to be featured my next board to video but it's being a boy barbie and we out for my city i'm the youngest nigga rapping oh my god oh my god if i die i'm a legend oh my god oh my god if i die i'm a legend i'm a first